Stage 4 Pancreatic Cancer Stage 4 pancreatic cancer indicates that cancer cells from the pancreas have moved to other regions of the body, such as the bones or lungs. This stage is also known as metastatic pancreatic cancer. Stage 4 pancreatic cancer is incurable. The 5-year survival rate ranges from about 2% to 12%, depending on the age upon diagnosis. However, there are treatments that can make a person at this stage of cancer feel better, palliative care. Pancreatic Cancer Statistics The American Cancer Society estimates that around 64,050 persons are diagnosed with pancreatic cancer. Approximately 50,550 people were anticipated to die from this malignancy. More than half of pancreatic cancer patients receive their diagnosis late. They only find out they have cancer when the cells begin to spread to distant organs at stage 4. This is known as late-stage diagnosis. Most people won't live more than 5 years after being diagnosed. Is stage 4 cancer terminal? There is no cure or treatment for terminal cancer. A person with terminal cancer is actively dying and will most likely die within a few months. Stage 4 pancreatic cancer is not necessarily considered terminal. Some people live for more than a few months with advanced or late-stage cancer. Stage 4 pancreatic cancer symptoms Pancreatic cancer is often discovered late since the symptoms are easy to miss. A person may be unaware that they have cancer since they are not feeling sick. Even if they do have symptoms, they may not affect them significantly. The symptoms of pancreatic cancer usually appear after the cancer cells have spread to other organs. The intestines are frequently one of the first places cancer appears. It can also spread to the liver, lungs, bones, and even the brain. When cancer spreads to other parts of the body, a person may have severe symptoms. They may also have major medical issues, like blood clots. Blood clots are sometimes known as deep vein thrombosis, DVT. This disorder is sometimes the first indication that someone has pancreatic cancer. A blood clot can cause discomfort, swelling, and redness wherever it occurs such as in a leg. Jaundice. Jaundice is caused by the presence of bilirubin, a yellowish fluid present in your liver. The liquid exits through a tube called the bile duct. If a tumor presses against the tube, the bilirubin can become backed up. This might cause a person's eyes or skin to turn yellow. They may have dark urine, light or oily stools, and itching skin. Gallbladder or liver enlargement. Your gallbladder contains bile. If it gets blocked up, the gallbladder or liver may expand. Belly or back pain. Tumors can put pressure on other organs or nerves, causing stomach or back pain. When this occurs, it may cause pain. Weight loss and poor appetite. Cancer patients frequently experience weight loss and a lack of appetite. They can feel nauseated and refuse to eat. If they don't eat enough, they can lose weight. Nausea and vomiting. When a tumor presses against the stomach, a person may feel nauseous. They may also throw up. Diabetes. The pancreas contains insulin-producing cells. Your body requires insulin to keep your blood sugar levels stable. If cancer affects the pancreas, it may be unable to regulate blood sugar levels. If this happens, the person may develop sudden diabetes. How long a patient live with stage 4 pancreatic cancer? There are limited therapy options for stage 4 pancreatic cancer. Even with treatment, most people do not live longer than a year or two. 
The average 5-year survival rate for those diagnosed with distant pancreatic cancer is 3.2%. This means that 3.2% of persons with stage 4 metastatic pancreatic cancer survive 5 years after being diagnosed. The number varies depending on age. People who are diagnosed at an early age have a higher chance of living longer lives. For example, someone under the age of 50 who is diagnosed with distant pancreatic adenocarcinoma has an 11.7% chance of living at least 5 years longer.